You want to get dressed? <coughs> She's going to get herself dressed. <laughs> Outfit of the day. Outfit of the day. <laughs> Come on, let's go party. Sit. Wait. Okay, go party. another video and today you guys today we're gonna give you a little update on Rye because Rye is giant okay she's still like small but she's so big from I feel like the last time you guys saw her I feel like we haven't vlogged in so long I also have tried to intro this video a few different times because I kind of forgot how to vlog but we're gonna give you an update on Rye and then also on Rue because I've been getting a lot of DMs asking if we still have Rue and yes you guys we still have Rue we still love Rue oh. <laughs> she's hungry one update on Rue, you guys, she's still eating the farmer's dog. We've been using the farmer's dog, I think, now for like two years. She eats her food, which I really love because before when she was eating like the highly processed kibble and all of that, I would have to like force her to eat. It would give me like just an extra thing that I had to do during my day is try to get my dog to eat. And I also just love knowing what's in farmer's dog. It's all like fresh ingredients. Rue gets beef, uh, turkey, and chicken. I think they have pork too. She's tried all of them and she Ooh. likes all of them. So you guys know we've been working with the farmer's dog for a while now in Rue and we've obviously kept that subscription. So this is what the package, this is what it comes in right here, but I actually need to go to our deep freezer where we store the rest of her food. They always send the food right on time. There's never been a time where we've ran out of food. So right now we only have Four more. She's coming to an end, but I just remember we actually just got a text a few days ago. They send a text and an email confirmation letting you know that your order is on the way. Oh my goodness, these are freezing. You all right? <laughs> Besides Rue absolutely crushing her food, which she still is down there, um, she's been much happier lately. As you guys saw earlier, we actually put up a fence in our backyard so she can run around and get out all her energy. We do have a code though for you guys, as we always do. There's a 50% off link in the description. Click that. Someone will go from the nap. Did you? Okay. <laughs> well, mommy will tell everybody that they can go get the farmer's dog Say, for 50% off. Doing our first integration. <laughs> <laughs> thank you, farmer's dog, for sponsoring this portion of the video. Say thank you. Thank you. So lately I've really been wanting to spring clean and like actually organize and go through some things. Before I can do that, I actually just need to like clean up in general. I feel like we do a pretty good job of keeping the house clean, but for some reason things just collect on this table. This is Rise Clean Laundry. A hat, some body wash. I don't know what happened here. Before having Rye, our table probably never would have looked like this. I feel like I always had everything super in order. I was very just wanted everything to be clean. And now I've kind of not like let go, but I think that's good. I think all parents have to realize that your house is just not gonna be the same anymore. Also, I wanted to show you guys a little hack I have for cleaning. If you have like multiple levels in your house, so this needs to go upstairs. So I just set stuff on the stairs for the moment being, and then once I actually go up there, I'll take the stuff upstairs. And same for our basement. So like this needs to go in the basement. So I'll just set it like near the basement and then go there when I actually need to go there because I'm just trying to get this area under control. So much better. There's your uh, motivation if you need some motivation to spring clean today. I have been wanting to 
put all of these toys away. It's so funny because right now I'm like, okay, this isn't that many toys, but like as soon as Rai just keeps aging, she's gonna have more stuff. I did get um, a basket actually, like for all of these little toys that are just chilling in the living room. So these are like my favorite um, baskets from Target. They're really cheap and I think that this one was actually on sale. Like I wanna say it was like $8. Kinda matches like our little poof, which needs to be fluffed. Lately, she's just been so much more fun. Like, she's obviously developing, and so getting new toys for her has been the best. Everything that she has in her hands goes directly into her mouth. So, like, we got her this little um, stacking rainbow. I actually got it on Amazon, so maybe I can link it for you guys. But it's obviously, like, for, you know, when she's older, and you, it's like a stacking toy, and you can go like this. But she loves this for teething. Like she puts it in her mouth and it's like that silicone. So I feel like she really likes it. We also got her like these little stacking cups. Josh, when he saw on TikTok, if you put like the stacking cups in front of them, it helps them to sit up. And Rai has been really doing good sitting up. And I think that like having something in front of her to kind of play with. She has, still has like this little mirror, which she likes, but this was more for when she was like younger and she was doing a lot of tummy time and stuff. My sister got her her first cell phone. It's so funny, I feel like parents say like anything with noise, you can just say that the batteries died like eventually when they're older and stuff. It has like an on and off switch and she doesn't really know so we can just turn it off. Look at that, toy basket complete. It's a toy basket. Oh, I was dropping her off. Oh, you were? Delivery. <laughs> Where are you going? <laughs> I need to go. We have a toy basket for Rue and she doesn't really like the basket because she wants all the toys out. Like she doesn't just want one. And I feel like that's gonna be the same case with you. Yeah, what's in there? <laughs> you got your rainbows, you got two. I have like a little bit of face makeup on today and I don't like wearing makeup because then I can't smush her cheeks as much. I mean, I can, but I just don't want to get my makeup on her, so I feel like I just can't smush as much. I feel like I could give you guys like a thousand updates on Rye because it's been so long, I feel like, since we've updated you on her. Good job. Good job. Did you spit up? No? Okay. <laughs> Good job, Rai Rai. Yes, yeah, I'm still a little wobbly. I'm still a little wobbly. We should go change your diaper. Daddy, there's the diaper king. Say, there's the diaper king. Don't hype me up just because you want me to change your diaper. <laughs> I know what you're doing. So it's currently 2.30 and usually I would have had a coffee already today because I usually drink a coffee first thing in the morning. But today I actually went to Orange Theory. I went to my workout class. So I don't like to drink coffee before I work out because I feel like it just doesn't sit right. I've been getting coffee out so much lately. Does anyone else, babe, tell them what I love to do. <laughs> Does anyone else keep an old coffee in the fridge because you're going to drink it the next day? <laughs> Baby! Okay, literally, you guys, I had two. Okay, one of them was probably like, okay, yeah, you shouldn't drink that. But then one was just from the day before, and who knows, even after, if it was ice and it melts a little, I know it's like, gets a little watery, but you just have to put some fresh ice in and then maybe just throw in some creamer and spruce it up, and it's like brand new. We had to order her like a whole new kind of like set of clothes because I feel like I was very prepared for like the newborn to like the zero to three month stage but I realized very quickly that she had like no clothes that fit her anymore and I feel like it happened so suddenly. So I've been kind of ordering stuff here and there because she needs stuff. It's also warming up and she had like a lot of like little sweat sets and stuff like that which i was like okay this is cute but these little zippies they have them i mean she actually has a couple other colors like some bright colors but i like the tan so i got her that okay this is six to twelve months old navy has some really good uh sales on baby clothes also got a swimsuit wait this is her first two piece babe what it's her first two piece no you guys, Josh says that Rai isn't going to be in a two-piece. Wait, this is so cute. Like, I would low-key wear this. Actually, yeah, I would wear this. 
maybe minus the ruffle. Okay, cute. Well, three fun little new things. See, and then I put them on the table, and this is how the table gets the way it was, because I just throw them here, and then they just live here for some time. All right, everyone in this house is getting packages. And your boy got a package too, so we're gonna open it up. This collab that Zara's doing, Rugi, I think is how you pronounce it, but this guy, he has his brand, and I've been following for so long, and this stuff is very expensive. So Zara did a collab and made some affordable stuff. Yeah, Y'all don't know what's in here though. Packaging, A plus. Wow, are they like short? I mean, no one's wearing long shorts anymore. Oh, wow. The jean shorts are back. I don't care what no one says. Even if you don't think they're back, they are 100% being on my body this summer. Well, we don't want that angle. What do you think, Rai? What do you think? You like daddy in jean shorts? Now, you already know my journey with the dad life. These just add to the dad. Oh, these boys crispy. You like them? Wait, where what side is it though, right there? Yeah. Do you like them? Yeah, baby. I love, I think jean shorts is cute. I didn't know that they ever went out of style. For dudes, it's not really, if you have any sense of fashion, you know that these are it. These, I'm doing something. I'm doing something. <laughs> it's a hot dad summer. Yeah. I have no support from my wife. You guys comment down below. Let me know what y'all think about these. No, baby, I love the shorts. Rai Rai! Hey! Hey, why are we crying? Why are we crying? We don't cry when we wake up. No, we don't. Hi! quickly show you guys like Rai's current sleep sack situation. So when Rai was newborn, we started her, this is actually the next size up, but we started her in the halo swaddle. So she had the newborn size and then she actually transitioned eventually. This is the next size up, this is the three to six month because she was actually swaddled until she was, I wanna say three to four months we started transitioning her out. We used the halo, the micro fleece I really think, I don't know, something about it. She was also a winter baby, but I just feel like it was extra warm and I feel like she really liked it. So we used that. We eventually transitioned her to the Dreamland baby. And this one is so nice. It has like Velcro inside, if you can kind of see. So this is actually like a swaddle. So we would still kind of swaddle her sometimes in this. That was like to help transition her from being fully swaddled. And then what's cool is it has buttons on the side so their hands can come out so like we would try like one arm out and then this is also weighted we slept in this for up until really recently actually we just transitioned her to this is the one she uses now which i need to order another one because it's good to have a backup this is the kite baby sleep sack as soon as we transitioned her to this she started sleeping on her stomach and on her side a lot more so i definitely know that she is done with the weighted one just because i think it's harder for her to roll i never did like a newborn must-haves video because I felt like I was still just in the thick of it and now I kind of feel like I have definitely have like my newborn favorites so maybe I'll have to share all my favorites let me know if you guys would be interested in something like that and like maybe I could do it on Instagram or here on YouTube especially for first-time mommies like me mommy's a first-time mommy okay thank you thank you thank you thank you do you really want me to drive? No, I drive. Okay. Yeah, I got you. <laughs> Show her, Thank you. Right now is definitely a rare sighting. My wife is on the driver's side. I don't drive ever, you guys. Unless I'm by myself, obviously. <laughs> well, yeah, no, we don't have a Tesla, and the Tesla doesn't drive us. I'm just saying, like, if we go somewhere together, when do I drive? Especially since Rai's been here. I Actually, think, since you've been pregnant. Yeah, I think it, that's when it kind of started. You don't like my driving, so you get a headache. <laughs> First of all, I don't talk like that. And I sometimes do get a headache when you drive because oh, wait, it's, I, think we're right on right. I do get a headache when my wife drives sometimes. And I'm a great driver. 
I wouldn't say great. What's happening right now, we are about to go to dinner. I actually ate today, which is crazy because when I have to work or do something, um, I rarely eat. My wife is literally about to crash. Well, Big Blue. No, don't blame him. Why was he coming out? My wife has not eaten anything. So I said, babe, how about this? How about you choose what we're eating? Don't tell me at all, you drive. And let's just see where you go. I know my way around clearly because you know I'm from here, but. Do I have like room to not know my way around still? Because I've lived here for, it'll be a year in it, August. It'll be a year in August. Yeah, um, my maps to go everywhere. She lived in LA for seven years and she still used her maps. Okay, but LA is like confusing, let's be honest. It's not that confusing because I got adjusted to in two years. I knew where Savannah's house was without GPS coming from like Hollywood to North Hollywood and she still needed her GPS. I just like GPS because it tells me if there's like an accident and stuff. That's not the reason why. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're pulling up. <laughs> <laughs> I should have taken this moment and really gotten something that you don't like. And I got something that you love more than me. That's a good wife. That's a great wife. I'm not mad at this choice at all. I just wanted you to choose what you wanted for dinner. And this is it. But I think the plan is we're not going to eat it here. We usually like to eat here yeah. at this specific one. But we might take it to a park, eat it at a park. It looks kind of like it's gonna rain. I don't think it's gonna rain anymore. It rained earlier today though. Okay guys, so Josh went into Chipotle actually, and I'm staying in the car because it's a little bit easier now. With this little Chiluli. What is, like, what is that nickname? Does anyone else call their baby everything but their actual name? I was gonna say I fully graduated to sitting in the front seat, but sometimes I sit in the back with her. I still, it just depends on your mood. Waiting for dad to come back. We're waiting for daddy to come back. Mm. I have not eight. I feel like if you're new and you haven't been around for a while, we love Chipotle, in case you didn't know. Salad with the shredded lettuce, chicken, white rice, mild corn, cheese, light sour cream. Only thing I gotta say, it goes McDonald's Sprite, Chipotle Sprite. Don't at me. Talk to me in the comments if you know what I'm talking about. Isn't uh, Chipotle owned by McDonald's? We don't have to talk about that. I mean, I, I, like, I like McDonald's. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's 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 open. Says grass for the first time. Do you like that? Is it fun? You weren't too sure about it. Huh? She didn't know what she was doing. <laughs> we just spend like 50% of our day staring at Rye. <laughs> we are back home from our little. Oh, sorry. I just took your book like so aggressively. Back home from Chipotle picnic date night. Um, it was actually like the perfect weather outside. It felt so good. Now we're gonna do bath time. Mm. You guys, Rai loves bath time. Dad always does bath time, which is nice. Oh, hi, Ruru. Say hi to your sister. I love you. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, you love you, doggy. <laughs> we do bath every night, unless, like, for some reason we have, like, a super late night. Sometimes we'll skip. First things first, we have to take off your clothes. But they can't see. <laughs> Ow, Ruru. Let go of while we were out at our pink picnic, I saw on our ring camera that our farmer's dog actually got delivered. Oh. Literally got here, and like I said, y'all saw earlier this morning, we still have three or four more uh, packages of food. That's your food, what, Rue. No one's called you Rye. <laughs> Daddy gives Rye a bath. I usually come in here and get her little area ready. I get her pajamas laid out and then this has like her lotion and her diapers and everything in it. She 
has been a sleeping queen. It's pretty much, I feel brand new. I think of both of us, but we are actually able to sleep through the night. Rai goes down between seven and eight, and then she wakes up between like 6.30 and seven every day. It's been pretty consistent for the past like three weeks, I would say, but for the first like six months of her life, well, almost six months, she definitely was waking up like multiple times a night. Sometimes she would sleep. It just really all was like fluctuating, but I feel like since we've been on such a good schedule and like routine with her, I feel like she just knows bath time, bed, and then she just sweeps. sweeps. <laughs> she just sleeps like a little queen. I do need to turn off the light in here. So we always do just this little lamp and then shut off the overhead light. And these curtains are the best because now that it's summer, it stays light longer. And I feel like Rai would be like, um, it's not time for bed if it wasn't dark in here. So the blackout curtains really help. Now we just wait for daddy. Everybody has just the right amount for them. The darker your skin, the more melanin you have. The lighter your skin, <laughs> yeah, baby. The lighter your skin, the less melanin you have. Melanin makes our skin bright right. Many beautiful shades from dark to light. What do you call your unique skin color? Our world has so many different groups of people, so there are lots of words we use. What groups do you belong to? Racism happens in a lots of big and small ways. I know. It's all around us, even when we don't always notice it. By changing unfair rules, by teaching, helping, learning, and listening, we can do it too. Yay! Are you ready to go to bed? Where are you? I just don't know where you're trying to blast off to. Parents signing off. <laughs> <laughs> it's so past my bedtime. What time it is 9.45. You guys, I go to bed at approximately 9. Well, actually, we go to bed at 9. We have been doing this new thing where we both go up. I know it's a thing because Savannah will be like, oh, babe, I'm going to bed. And I'll be like, nice. I'll see you when I get up there. But lately, I want her been... to come with me. I mean, what? <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm so, I'm so used to Rye. <laughs> I am your husband. I want my husband to come to bed with me. Tonight, I need to edit mm -hmm. so we can get this video sent to the brand so they can approve it. Anyways, <laughs> we wanted to close this video out. No, Josh wants to close the video out. This felt good to be vlogging today. I was gonna say, let us know if you guys missed the vlogs because I feel like I haven't, we haven't properly like vlogged like this wow. since I don't even know how long. Let's go to bed. Let me finish editing. No. <laughs> We love you guys, and we'll see you in the next video. Wow, that was such a throwback. Am I? Is there two? Am I? Which way are you going? Am I in the same lane as them? How? They're in their own lane? Yes. Are you sure? I just don't want to cut them. Let's pray for me. Sorry, I have to focus while I park. <laughs> I just got my license. <laughs> Clearly. Okay. You need to eat something. Say, Mommy, feed me. Okay. How do I turn this off? Oh, you want to turn it off? Why can't Mommy find the button? Mommy lost it. Where is it, Rai? Oh, there it is. Oh, Rai has a camera. <laughs> 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 <Baby>. <laughs>